Everyone, how's it going? Uh, if I sound a little weird, I'm sick, so sorry. Um, I'm going to talk about my thoughts on Pirates of the Caribbean 4 on Stranger Tides. I really can't wait for it. It seems pretty good. Um, what happens in here is that Jack, as we know in the last movie, took the chart and he has a location of the Fountain of Youth. And plus with the compass that can, you know, lead him to anywhere he wants to go, it'll help him out. So, eventually he's dragged off to um, these guys and, you know, he has to work with Barbosa, who is no longer a pirate. As he said in the trailer, he is King's Men. And he has a peg leg. He lost Black Pearl from Blackbeard. And as he said, his ship has actually turned against him. So, Blackbeard, possibly. I'm not really sure. Maybe Barbosa exa is exaggerating. But yeah, Barbosa is uh, saying that, you know, the Black Pearl came to life and, you know, became Blackbeard. So, yeah, that's going to be a little weird. Um, but yeah, um, so Blackbeard is also after the Fountain of Youth and, um, you know... Jack also has to deal with mermaids because he has to go, you know, sacrifice a mermaid to get to this fountain of youth, apparently. Like, we don't really know exactly what they have to do with the mermaid. Um, and they have to deal with zombies who are guarding it. So they got to deal with a lot of supernatural crap um, to get to the fountain of youth. Um, and by the way, again, the mermaids are not going to be easy because they show in the trailer that these mermaids are not like the little mermaids at all. Like, you know, like, I know it's a Disney film, but they're exact opposite. They're like piranhas. They'll freaking jump and grab them and do who knows what um, to them. Like, possibly just eat them or something. I don't know what they're going to, what those mermaids would do. They're probably just going to drown them. Um, but, yeah, they're going to have to deal with mermaids and then have to fight the zombies. Um, while also having the whole, you know, they're pirates, so they have to betray um, each other, like, a few times. They're going to have those moments clearly in here since, you know... Um, as we've seen in the trailer, Jack has to, you know, uh, pretend to work with Blackbeard to, you know, stay alive. So, we're going to have that. Um, um, I know one thing I know a lot of people are going to agree with me on this one. When they get to the Fount of Youth, there's going to be a twist to it. Because every time they, um, in these pirate movies, when they find a chance for eternal life, somehow, some way, there's going to be some stupid crap involved. There's some dark, evil twist to anything that basically has eternal life involved. Like, maybe it might, but there's a good chance it will have that twist. Like, the Ill to Murda, like, you know, if you take the gold from the Ill to Murda, you'll be living forever, but you're going to be a freaking zombie, and the only way people will tell is if you're in direct moonlight, and, you know, they'll see that you're a zombie. It's kind of weird, like, you know, there's a moment in part one where, like, these pirates are attacking people at night, and... I know some people are going to tell me that, you know, it was cloudy, so no one notices. But there's a point where the moon is actually showing. Shouldn't some people actually warn them, like, what, did the pirate like, I know, like, there's possibly that the pirates killed all the guys that probably saw them as zombies, but still. What the heck? Um, but yeah, like, you know, there's a possibility that the Fountain of Youth has that, and, um, has, like, this dark twist. Like, they're probably going to go with the idea that maybe if you drink from the Fountain of Youth, you have to, you know, keep drinking it to keep the effects on you because the effects are only temporary. And that's what most people will say about the Fountain of Youth, that, you know, it's only temporary. So, who knows? Um, you know, I, I really can't wait to see this movie. It looks really good. I'm a Pirates of the Caribbean fan. I saw all the movies and liked them. I will review them and when the movie... To build up for my review in the movie. Um, and that's all I got to say. Um, hope you like the video. Goodbye.